Hey guys, and welcome to the Exodus channel, your home for the best crypto videos. Make sure you hit those subscribe and like buttons and we will keep the videos coming. With a name inspired by the coastal beach in California, Solana is a blockchain that has breezed into the race to be the fastest, most secure and scalable solution in crypto land. How does it measure up? Will it edge out Ethereum or other high performance blockchains like Cosmos? Let's find out what is Solana and what's the use case of the Solana coin SOL. Solana's team includes former technologists from Qualcomm, Intel, Netscape and Google. Its CEO, Natalie Yakovenko himself, has software engineering experience from Qualcomm and Dropbox. When you look at our team, it's not surprising that we're able to build this ridiculously fast blockchain. The Solana network was actually able to raise funding from investors such as Multicoin Capital, Foundation Capital, and Distributor Global to the tune of $25 million. Now let's get into the nitty gritty stats. First, scalability. Solana scales as a layer one blockchain at the rate of Moore's law, which states that processing speeds are double every two years. Simply using CPU, GPU power, there is no need for charging or other complicated layer two solutions that compromise security and stability. We'll get into how Solana achieves this later. Next, speed. Solana creates a block every 400 milliseconds with sub-second confirmations and transaction speeds of 50,000 per second. With such speeds, Solana has already passed Ethereum in terms of block count. This has led some people to call Solana the world's first web scale blockchain, as it has transactional capacity comparable to the internet. Next, validators. Solana has a global network of over 350 validators, ensuring network security and stability. Anyone can be a validator on Solana with no minimum staking requirement. Finally, fees. Solana costs about $10 for every 1 million transactions, making it one of the lowest cost chains around the block. In comparison though, Ethereum transaction costs an average of $2. What makes Solana different? Well, Solana puts forward eight core innovations that differentiate it from the competition, and they are proof of history, tower Byzantine fault tolerance, turbine Gulfstream sea level, pipeline cloud break, and archivers. But we're only going into proof of history, which is actually Solana's key innovation and secret source, allowing it to offer blazing fast transactions at 50,000 transactions per second. Despite the name, POH is not actually a consensus mechanism like proof of work or proof of stake. POH is actually a cryptographic clock in Solana's blockchain that allows nodes to agree on the time and the ordering of events without having to actually talk to each other. This information tells us what event had to come before another. Each Solana node maintains its own clock by encoding the passage of time in a simple SHA-256 sequential hashing verifiable delay function. This is a mouthful of words, so think of it graphically like this. Imagine taking a picture of yourself, holding a newspaper, showing the date and the time, and publishing the photo in the next issue of the newspaper. POH works in a similar way to record time, almost like a cryptographic timestamp. This decreases node messaging overheads and other computation bulk, so allowing Solana to reach its high speeds. Solana's unique offering has attracted over 100 projects in DeFi, Web3, blockchain gaming to date. So let's look at some of them. First up, the crypto derivatives platform FTX, founded by Forbes 30 under 30, Sam Bankman Free. Hey guys. So FTX actually launched a high speed decentralized exchange called Serum on Solana, which means they actually leverage Solana's capabilities to offer sub-second settlements with minimal transaction fees. Solana and Serum, you can actually run you know, massive volumes of trading through the thing. Next, Audius. The community-owned audio streaming platform has also chosen to partner with Solana and is actually currently working on migrating its content management system with a catalog of over 150,000 audio tracks to the Solana blockchain. Finally, Chainlink, the oracle providing data fees to decentralized exchanges, is also partnering with Solana to develop a high-frequency oracle that will be able to provide price updates every 400 milliseconds. With promising partnerships, Solana's ecosystem is growing fast and carving out a formidable niche in the cryptocurrency space. Solana's mainnet is currently running in beta mode since March 2020 and has processed over 7 billion transactions to date. However, recently on the 4th of December 2020, Solana experienced an outage which lasted for 6 hours. The network managed to resume function eventually, with commentators reminding that Ethereum 2 of course had teething problems during its early days. 
What about the SOL token? The SOL token is a NATO cryptocurrency on Solana's network and is used for transactions on the blockchain, including for micropayments. Users can also delegate and stake SOL and earn additional rewards. There is currently a circulating supply of 26 million SOL with a total maximum supply capped at 489 million. What's your take on Solana? What are your price predictions for SOL? Hit the like button and the subscribe button and let us know your thoughts in the comment section below.